amount um, information timeout by default is setting as the 10 minutes here as well so that's the okay so that means my b1i uh, b1ic backend um, specifically for my b1 uh, mobile package I got to use the um, SSL secure transportation there that means I'm I should enable I should using the I should using the uh, uh, the port HTTPS port there, okay. So, so that means I need to put the port A443 instead of A080. That's non-secure, okay. And then, in the same time, um, I also need to switch on um, the SSL connection. Um, this means we need to uh, conf configure this one SSL on here uh, for the connection uh, to my backend. So that means the um, the the configuration in my mobile package in the backend um, and also in the my iPhone application setting for business one here they match um, each other uh, by the right um, B1i server and the right port and the right and SSO connection or not here so that's the first one we need to be we need to check so and um, um, Last but not least, uh, because maybe you um, you be one IC server, you also have the firewall, maybe antivirus or or something like that. So that means you need to be sure uh, the port uh, in the in the firewall ha A four four three in this case has been ena enabled um, in your firewall um, here. So uh, you just maybe to some simply for uh, for the testing, maybe you just disable your your firewall or disable your firewall. Uh, or something like that, uh, or whatever. Uh, just be sure the port, uh, the connection, the request sent from the iPhone application through the port um, A four four three to the B one IC server can go through here. So uh, either you can have a checking by to to using some command line to testing by the, using the uh, to testing the the network connection between um, the B1IC server and the iPhone application there with the command line using telnet or pin there. So the the first one, um, the first um, you can try um, you can try to ping um, the your iPhone application, your iPhone uh, IP address uh, from your B1IC server. That that means be, just be sure your iPhone can uh, your B1IC can ping. Um, your iPhone, okay. And secondly, also uh, maybe you can go to another machine, uh, not the um, not the B1IC machine here. So just telnet, try to telnet your B1IC server, your B1IC server um, here, and then also the port here. Um, uh, just be sure, just go to another machine and telnet your B1IC server. Just be sure uh, you can go through, you can telnet your B1IC server with the with the port A443 there. So okay, for me, uh, because I am I'm, I'm using my own machine here, so just give you an idea here. Just um, telnet uh, my my own machine here. So as you can see, I can telnet. Um, I can tell uh, my my B1IC server. That means the port A443. I can go through my A443 here. Okay. So that is the um, that's the connection uh, for the um, um, setting for the B1I server against the mobile setting um, here. Okay. Maybe the second root cause for the connection fail. Well, obviously um, the second root cause. Um, if you are B1I Indication service is not starting. Of course, you are you certainly you will get the connection fail um, that in th in that kind of a um, th phase. So another another general um, um, checklist is you can just um, for example you can go to you can open your iPhone you can open your iPhone um, now you can open your iPhone for example this is my own iPhone this screen is my iPhone here and then you just uh, open the browser um, and then just try to um, uh, uh, try try to connect your B1IC uh, B1 B1IC um, server and then the port A0 A0 there and then make sure you uh, you can browse the uh, by default you we should be able to see the the Tomcat uh, homepage um, um, here you should be able to see the uh, Tomcat uh, homepage there if you cannot see the uh, Tomcat uh, homepage from your iPhone browser and uh, that means the um, uh, maybe something 
something wrong with your um, integration service. Maybe the integration service is not started, or maybe um, some other program is using the pool A0, A0 uh, in that case. So in, in that case, you need to uh, you need to be sure to go to your B1IC server to figure out uh, who is using the A0, A0 um, pool there uh, for the further um, troubleshooting there. Um, so for me, I I uh, I would be I should be able to see the uh, Tomcat home homepage from the my my iPhone there um, as well. Just to be sure the connection, the network connection um, works good between the uh, B1i uh, B1i server and your iPhone there. Okay. Uh, thirdly, we already talked about um, so um, if your backend if your backend um, mobile package you are using the um, Security connection. You should you you should enable the you should switch on. You should switch on the SSL setting here. Switch on SSL setting here as well. 